April Fool, written and illustrated by me, Evelyn Winters. For Caden and Kyla. For Evelyn Winters as an answer. Caden is the Chester Clown. He's always laughing and whizzing around. He is so funny with oodles of jokes and likes tricking friends and visiting folks. He loves nothing more than to play the big fool. Most people laugh as a general rule. But on April Fool's Day, it's not so much fun when you are the one he is playing tricks on. Abracadabra, turn my sister into a frog. Am I really a frog? On the big day at the crack of dawn, Caden is up before anyone can yawn. Ooh! Between being excited and needing the loo, he could be planning tricks to play on you! Daddy's alarm clock says the wrong time. It turns nine and starts to chime! He's not happy to be woken so soon. Out of his window he can still see the moon. Caden is sniggering because he has more. He's attached party poppers to his sister's door. It gives her a shock to hear all that loud sound. First thing in the morning, it makes her head pound. A couple of bumblebees fly into a see-through trap. Their doorway is covered in a cling film wrap. Now they are stuck and they can't get free. That is no life for a little honeybee. Mummy is not pleased with the frozen eggs and Caden smearing jam all over her pegs. The tricks he's playing and the stuff he's using are not being found to be very amusing. Caden tells Daddy his laces are undone. He believes him, but it's just a bit of fun. Now these pranks are going to have to stop. So Daddy puts the time forward on the kitchen clock. Caden thinks it's tea time and not time to play. And his family treat him to an April Fool's Sunday. He can't wait to fill his little hungry tummy. The ice cream they give him looks so yummy scrummy. But when he tastes what is in the dish below, it doesn't taste like ice cream but mashed potato. Yuck! April Fool! All his family cry. I don't like mash came Caden's reply. The end. If you enjoyed this story, don't forget to hit that subscribe button just below the video to be notified of more.